guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting green to episode 10 of Assault Lily. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I'm still upset about Yuri. I mean, y'all did her wrong. Y'all really did her wrong. Oh, y'all did her wrong. Y'all did her so fucking wrong. I swear to God. That's so fucked up. I mean, yes, characters are supposed to die no matter what. But still, y'all fucked her over. She was the newest character. Out of all the characters you killed, you killed the newest character who just so happened to join the group. How long has she been in the show? Like, two or three episodes? And then y'all was like, fuck it, we're just gonna go ahead and kill her. And I'm just like, bruh. <clears throat> like, as much as I knew or had a feeling she was not going to be in this mobile game, I was like, oh, maybe. Like, they might not do anything. They might make a special case for her. She might be one of those, like, type cards that you have to use to possibly level up the girls in the game. I don't know. But y'all literally said, fuck it, we're killing her. It's okay. Just don't kill anybody else, please. We got, like, what? Either two or three more weeks with this show, and I'm guessing it's two. So, <laughs> please don't. Oh, really? Why is she petting her pillow like that? I mean, <laughs> like it's a cat. I get that, but come on, man. She just lost Yuri. I was her, like, her daughter. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's bullshit. I know how you feel, honey. Yuri had it. Yeah, Yuri, he had that too, but. <laughs> the fact that, like, she came in just to embrace her and just talk to her for a little while. I mean, that's mom and dad just comforting over their child. The, the loss of their child. I mean, because they both loved Yuri. <laughs> Kaede. Yeah. Maybe someone could make her a new one. I mean, honestly, you, you and that thing is in the ocean. It'd just be better to just make her a new one. Well, yeah, 
up, like, to make one. I mean... You're right. <laughs> oh, big time. Yeah, I get the fact that you don't want her to end up like you. It's either that or possibly having Yuri come back to life, but I don't think they're going to have that happen, aren't you? Oh, but you, you. Oh. Hmm. Well, I hope you're able to find it. I wonder how long this is gonna take, though. Until tomorrow. Okay. Looks like a show. <laughs> I know. I mean, I don't want to get into, like, despair-inducing moments, but, I mean, honestly, it just seems impossible that you girls are going to find it. Bless you.
What's that one? Two faces so right there? Oh, I would have loved to see that, but no, they killed her. Hmm. No, Lily, you did everything for her. I really couldn't give me a happy ending with this family. Nothing still. Huh. Or you could just find the place that Lily's dad bought it from. <laughs> Oh, Katie. <laughs> it's fine. Bless you, Kayere. <laughs> oh my god. Uh-huh, that's what you two get, though.
Huh? That's her actual one. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Really? Because I kept wondering what that little bit was. That's so messed up, Kayane, but I get that. Well, that just tells you how much she loves Lily. I know. You did what you thought was right. Even though... Mm, but still. And honestly, if Yuri was still alive, we still would have had like matching, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh. Because You miss Gary. She needed that, honestly. I think everybody needed that because, like I said, I'm so pissed about that shit from last week.
So it makes you wonder, is it a possibility to bring the dead back to life? I mean, with how many other episodes we have left of this show, do I really think it's possible? A little bit of yes and a little bit of no. If it is, then, then in the end, they have a way to bring both people that Yuri and you both love back. I mean, honestly, it would be nice, but in real world situations, that could never happen. If it could, there's so many people that we could bring back, but you can't. This was an episode I think we all needed after last week because losing Yuri was the hardest thing, really, for me. I can't say for anyone else, but for me, it was hard. I mean, if it was any one of these girls, I would have been just as much as a mess, if not even more, but having Yuri... And connecting with her with the little time that we got with her was sweet. But I wish we still got just more with her instead of the few episodes we got with her and her dying. Still, y'all really fucked us over. But the fact that you was there and everyone else was there to just embrace Lily. That was really needed. The same thing you did, Yuri. I mean, Lily. Exactly. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That, and you never really get to see that person ever again. So, everything that you wanted to tell that person. You can never tell them. Mm -hmm. Oh God, don't do that again, please. It's, it's too much. That makes sense to do that because, I mean, her spirit is still connected to Yungun, so it makes the most sense to do this and to have an episode where even though she is dead, she technically gets to meet Lily and has her own thoughts on Lily, I, I don't know how it's going to go, but I mean, we ain't going to know it till next Friday, but I, I don't think <sighs> Yun Yun Shisho, our si older sister, will be um hard or mean on her. I just think she's going to really observe her. I don't think we're going to have a moment where Lily's going to be able to see her and have a conversation with her as much as I want that, but who knows this was a really like last week's episode was heartbreaking this was just you know really everyone banding together and trying to look for something even though yes what Kayeri did was wrong she still did it I'm still I'm not pissed at her or anything I get the fact of why she did it because I mean there was nothing else she could do and she wanted to be helpful and such and I get the fact is that yes like Lily Oh, I'm about to cry. <laughs> Lily cared so much for Yuri and 
like I said, Yuri was like their daughter in a way. And so it just felt like even seeing Yunyun and Lily like embracing, it just reminds you like, oh my God, if anyone hasn't seen that one like 12 minute short that's on Netflix, um, I don't remember the name of it, but it's so freaking good. It's one of the saddest things that I've ever seen. Like, I, I, I'm like, I, I feel like I'm the type of person where, like, I cry more at anime than I can at, like, anything else. And then I watched that 12-minute short with my mom, and I was, like, a baby crying. And I just couldn't stop crying. Like, I, I thought that, like, when it is one of my family members' death, I can barely cry and such. And the day that my aunt passed away, I was just in my room just, like, bursting. And sometimes I have those moments even still with anything that I think about that makes me cry. But, like, oh, God, just, mm. This was something I think we all needed. A really good cry, especially Lily. She needed this just to make herself feel better. And I'm glad she feels a little bit better. It's going to take time for her to get used to the fact that Yuri isn't going to be around and it's going to be the same thing for the rest of us. But who knows what the hell is going to happen next week. The fact that, you know, New Year's Sea Show is coming back in a really weird way. But who knows? Other than that, guys, that was my reaction view towards episode 10 of Assault Lily. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially next Friday, Saturday, for episode 11. Bye, guys.